Hello and welcome to the biology topic, human body, lesson four, drugs. We are going to look in this topic at what a drug is. We're going to look at the different types of drugs. We're going to look at the effects of those drugs and examples of them as well. OK, so um, you've got five images there of different drugs. OK, some are legal, some are illegal, some are medicines. OK, so you've got um, coffee beans to represent caffeine. There's some paracetamol tablets. Uh, there's a photograph there of cannabis. Um, you've got oil uh, with the spoon. That is heroin. And the picture above is to represent steroids. OK, so those are all drugs, but you need to know the definition of what a drug is. OK, so a drug is classed as a substance that alters the way that your body works. Um, that will affect certain things. It will affect, um, it could affect the activity of your brain. It could affect your energy levels. It could affect your pain threshold. It could affect the clarity with which you think. OK, now some drugs are legal and many, many drugs are illegal. Now, recreational drugs are those that are taken for enjoyment. Uh, there are also drugs like paracetamol and ibuprofen, as two examples, um, that we take as medicine. OK, now there are also um, recreational drugs that are legal for certain ages. So you can um, think of alcohol as this. OK, now. Uh, they're moving on from that. Many of these drugs are harmful. So some drugs are more easily accessible, but they're still incredibly harmful. So alcohol is a good example of this. It's legal from the age of 18, but extremely um, addictive and can be very damaging. The negative effects include the damage to the liver and the brain. And also the fact it slows down reaction times. It's also classed as a depressant. And as we've already mentioned, it's very addictive. So um, solvents are other harmful drugs. They're found in substances around the home. They can be present in um, paints and aerosols and glues. OK, what we now have are many solvent free alternatives. So they're not as common as they used to be. But again, they're addictive. And when they are used, they can cause hallucinations. They also damage the brain, kidneys, liver and the lungs. Um, these solvents will also cause a person's behaviour to change. OK, so they're harmful. These ones are dangerous. So many of the illegal drugs are dangerous and can lead to death. So we're talking about hallucinogens, stimulants, painkillers. Okay, all of those are dangerous. Now, um, what's important to remember is a hallucinogen um, is something like uh, LSD or ecstasy or solvents that will um, affect the messages sent to the brain. OK, and that's what causes you to think you're seeing things that aren't really there. Now, stimulant um, amphetamines known as speed, also coffee. They will give you the feeling of additional energy. They affect the reaction times. OK. Um, they're also you can become psychologically dependent on them. The barbiturate or alcohol will reduce brain activity and it will slow reaction times down. OK, so um, that you think of why you're not allowed to drink and drive. That's because your reaction times have been impaired. OK, you're not allowed to take any of these drugs. You're not allowed to drive under the influence of any of these drugs. But to use alcohol as an example, that's partly why your reactions are not as quick. And then painkillers. Um, paracetamol and aspirin are two examples. One of the more harmful ones, dangerous ones, is morphine, although any of them are dangerous if taken in excess. These reduce the pain, um, but they don't always address the issue. They just, they can remove the pain for a period of time, but they don't deal with the cause of the pain, okay? They will mask the pain. 
you need to be able to categorize the drugs so you need to be able to say which ones are legal which ones are illegal so also remember when we talked about medicines antibiotics as well and remember nicotine in cigarettes all of those are legal um although they may have an age limit on and then illegal um we talked about cannabis um and amphetamines also ecstasy cocaine lsd heroin all illegal okay so um you need to take a look at the worksheet and see if you can answer the questions make sure you're clear on the category of drugs and the main four different types that are listed here on this slide and that you can give examples okay and the make sure you know the effect that each type of drug has on the body and if you need to re-watch this again to help you complete that worksheet we will see you again very soon.